Murray's race number is 912, in memory of the date, the 9th of December, that he was blown up. The first thing he did after leaving Headley Court was buy himself a bike, but he could never have imagined racing one, until now. This weekend, Murray will be on the track for the Triumph Triple Challenge, one of the lead support races at the British Superbike Championships. A little nervous, a little excited, but yeah, really keen to get out on track. Uh, just hoping for the sun to come out and the track temperature to pick up and then hopefully get some good times in. Now, you were into motorbikes before your, you got injured, but did you ever imagine you'd be racing at Brown's Hatch? Not at all, no. Uh, I'm still sort of trying to get over it myself. It's uh, you know two years ago after being involved in the uh, IED, to being here now is just unbelievable. And what have been the sort of challenges and complications to the, you know in getting here? Um, well, everything's put on the handlebar now because uh, not having movement in the feet means that. Uh, I've had to take everything from the changing gear up onto the handlebars to the rear brakes as well. Whilst in rehab, being advised to find a new hobby only made Murray more determined to get back on two wheels. It's this tenacity and his backstory that's won him a lot of friends in the motorcycling community, including his mentor, who's been racing since she was eight years old. Oh, it's ten times harder than what we're doing. It's I've tried to ride his bike and I couldn't do it. It's just everything's done by the hands, you know, and he's had to put a bolt through on his foot to keep his feet on. And, you know, it makes us look stupid because we have it so easy compared to him. And yet he's still out there doing it and giving it everything, you know, and qualifying and beating people and getting quicker. And it's brilliant to see the way he's improved through such a short period of time. Providing vital support, leading air engineering technician Adam Schroff has been working all hours to get this bike ready for competition. True Heroes Racing want to encourage other injured service personnel to come on board, not only to race, but also on the technical side. We want to be able to offer them something else to focus on and to look at, but we'd also like to be able to try and offer some work placements, is something we're looking to do with the project, to try and reintroduce these guys back into a working environment um, and you know we're looking to do that with our sponsors through the motorsport industry but not only motorsport all in you know just to be able to offer something for these guys to do qualifying for the triumph triple challenge takes place on saturday morning before the big race on sunday afternoon having only picked up the bike last week this is the first opportunity murray's had to race this triumph daytona 675r motorcycle it doesn't promise to be an easy ride, but Murray, for one, has faced far bigger challenges. Gath Brazier, Forces News, Brands Hatch.